Hi, Sam Tobit, Sound of Joy Music Services, and we're on to our next viewer request, Kevin Lemons, For Your Good. Let's get after it. All right, this song is written in the big band format, and there's a lot of uh, brass instruments being used, so you had to had to hear between the chords and sorry about that camera's giving trouble and to be I had to hear between the chords to find the real basic chords to get you through the song and they may not be so basic so let's go to B flat and do our opening scale left hand and back down camera behave yourself so I'm not going to give you that opening there's a lot that happens in the intro but you'll be able to find it within that this sort of uh, the, the real bass chords Again, trying to find the highest note and the lowest note, which is the bass note, and the highest note, which is the piano, in a sense, where they're placing those notes at. There it is. Now, it could be here or here. that change over to get you here. Now these chords are common to me. I've used them in the past on other songs, just not on this song, so I had to hear where they were going. Because the musicians are basically going crazy. So they're, they're singing, they're playing around what the choir voicing is. So this, these chords will get you into the song. Resolve to an E flat and to a B flat. The turnaround is the tritone. Gotta love these cameras. And back into the choir voicing and just resolve it around there. Now, I'm not giving you the bass because the bass player is is having a ball on this one. But if I'm going to give you a bass on that. If you're going to add a bass, that's your bass. But you want to hit that full chord. Okay, so, and this song is all what I call patterns and uh, and modes. You're going to hear those chords only in this part of the song. Then it's going to give you this chord. Another turnaround. It's a full. I'm trying to give that what that bass is doing. Really, you want this chord. Okay, I'm going to put you on uh, mute so I can give you the correct chording uh, pattern for this, this, this part of the section. Thank you. 
All right, so I listened to that, and you saw me playing along with it. And that dip down. Again, when you listen to the song, you'll see where these chords with the bass. Then it's going to drop down. Um, let me get that change. Okay. So why don't you come out of a I got that right. Let me just verify that. All right, so much movement. Um, Got to get that one chord I'm missing. Put that one chord in there. Be right back. Okay, gotta listen to the lyrics. Why don't you come out of It's gonna work. It's gonna work for you. So you're gonna have to time these chords with the lyrics. It's gonna work. It's gonna work. Now it goes into some nice smooth chords again. Let me just verify where those chords are so I can give those to you. Be right back. All right, we're into the next set of patterns. After you come out of um, for your you slow it down. I'm trying to really break it down. It's really, it's this full, come up, it's gonna work, it's gonna work, it's going to work. Different ways to approach it. Different 
ways to approach the same core or changes. So that's going to get you through. It's going to work. Let me see where this goes. Okay, so it's going to bring you out of um then back into higher notes. And that's it's, it's going to work. It's going to work. It's going to work. It's going to you the, the the root notes of what's happening there but check the that's where you that's where you want to really want to end with that full bum, 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 bum. all right so let me take you to the next part be right back things happening. The bass is doing this music is happening in between the choir singing it's going to work now we're getting ready to change key into D flat then we go this is, what, this is how you're gonna work those chords hold it down so you can hear that change you roll out of it. Let me just verify that. All right, there's a lot of music free happening there. There's that run. Okay. Here we 
we go. That's for the, the for your good while they're doing that. Then there's a change. Da, 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 for your good. Mm. I believe that's the change. The Forbes. Let me verify that. Be right back. Okay, so I can't let you hear what I'm listening to, but they're starting here. This is that climb. Just climbing. Again, this this is that climb near the end, getting close to the end. Basically, going from um, B flat to D flat to E flat to F to A flat to B flat again. Now G flat and uh, F. I've covered 80% more than I thought I was going to cover this song. Go back, listen to the same uh, track that I've been listening to on YouTube. You will see where those chords will match up for you. If they are too advanced, please send me a, put a comment in there. I'll see if I can break it down even more. But really, this type of song has this much chordal mustard in it and relish in just about every other seasoning, and there's a lot of big band sound. There's a lot of um, Carib uh, not Caribbean, but um, um, classical sounds in it. It's, it's full of music. That's what I'm trying to say. But Sound of Joy Music Services, please like, subscribe, share this video, and of course, leave your comments. Keep them coming. Sam Tobit, Sound of Joy Music Services. Take care. <laughs>